Okay, this is a EVGA SR2 Fritz benchmark test using two X5667 processors. This is a six core each socket, two sockets with hyper threading off. I'm going to try to hit 60 in relative speed. See what it'll do. I'll zoom in. Show 12 threads. I'll pull the task manager up here in a second and show that it's 12 threads with hyper threading off. Of course it's overclocked. It usually gets between 59 and 60, somewhere close to 60. There you go, 60.13 at 28860 and running cool. Of course, we expect it to run cool. The bench test is so short. And it's air cooled, uh, two Noctua D14s, uh, solid state drive. Uh, video cards, of course, not related, but it's got two 470, two of the old 470s. And the RAMs, the uh, OCZ, uh, 12 gigs of RAM, OCZ Gold. The timing is 10, 10, 10, 30. I've got that tightened up a little bit. So, 12 threads, hyper threading off, 60.13, 28,860. Now, let me pull up the task manager which is right there and that shows 12 threads let me back out a little bit so there you go I would it'd be a little more authentic to leave the task manager open while you're running a bench test but it takes some some of it off, some of the canyons a second off when I do that. So I leave everything closed. Of course, nothing's running in the background. Uh, it's Windows 7 Ultimate. Uh, so you can see 12 threads in the task manager. I'll zoom in one more time. So there it is, 6013. These EVGA SR2s, I know there's a lot of them out there. Guys are overclocking more than I am. And there's a whole lot of guys better than I am at overclocking. Uh, but I still uh, have fun doing it. I built my own system. Uh, temperature in my room is about 72 for this air cooling. Uh, mine's not in a case. Mine's in a bench. Uh, models just sitting on the floor by the air conditioned duct. Okay, I just want to do this because that last video I didn't hit 60 and it was uh, not a very good video so I'm going to try to upload this and see if I can get rid of those black bars that are common on YouTube videos now. Thanks for watching.